Well, hello there. So I've been asked a question this afternoon about depression. So I've got a multi-layered answer for you about depression. So the very first thing you can do if you feel depression hit and you still feel like you can move is to go outside and to go somewhere where you find nature. So particularly lucky out here being by the beach, listening to the sound of the waves. So going into nature is one of the simplest things you can do that's a great value. And another thing you can do, which is also very helpful, is to start to do some deep breathing. This helps a great deal as well. And the more you go into deep breathing, the more you'll find that that state starts to lift. However, there are times when a quick fix is not the answer. And so that's really what this film is dedicated towards examining. So the first thing to realize when you're experiencing depression, you will have gone into your head because there'll be thoughts that are playing out. And it'll be the judgments about the thoughts that are most likely to cause a depression. You might get into various opinions and judgments about your life, what you're doing, questions about why you're here, what it's all about. And one of the things that people tend to do most easily to get out of this situation is to simply engage in some physical activity and certainly physical activity is something that helps because it's a distraction. Reading books can be a distraction, so can watching TV, all these things can be a distraction. And because of that they don't really address the issue. So with shamanism it's always nothing is as it seems. So the nothing is as it seems about depression is this. When you get hit by a really big black depression, it's because you are preparing for something. And there is an insight coming your way. Now the way to grasp hold of this insight is to do exactly the opposite of what you might think. So what we tend to want to do is to distract ourselves and actually the answer to, to depression is to do the opposite, the exact opposite, which is to go into the feelings and to really feel exactly what it is you're feeling and at first you might start off with your thought train playing out a series of words to describe the feelings and what I invite you to do is to go deeper still to go so deeply into feeling exactly what it is that you're feeling that even the thoughts start to leave you and this really is the answer to depression because the more you go into how you feel the more you refuse to be distracted in all the many methods that you might use, the more you are actually moving rapidly towards a breakthrough. So this is the gift. All depressions represent, in a sense, a breakdown. There's something you're not satisfied about. There's something that doesn't feel right. There's something that feels wrong. So what we do when we go into our feelings as deeply as possible, there comes a moment when you realize, yes, here I am. I'm breathing. I'm feeling, this is where I am. And this is a springboard into what we call surrender. And when you truly to surrender to exactly what is, because it's a useful thing to remember, this comes from David the Shaman Chef, and the words are simply, it is what it is. So whatever it is that you're feeling, whatever your circumstances happen to be, it all is what it is. Now, a lot of the common causes a person might start to focus on in their rational mind could do, be to do with money, or perhaps their self-image, or perhaps their opinions about what they're doing. But when you go really deeply into the feelings, this is your opportunity to have your breakthrough. And it is through surrender, through accepting exactly everything as it is, and most especially and most importantly, including you. It's accepting you. Here I am. I'm inhabiting a body, I'm breathing, I'm in this place and I'm feeling whatever it is that I'm feeling. The deeper you go into the feelings, the quicker you will reach the breakthrough moment. And that could be an insight about something about the way you're living your life. It could be any number of things. But ultimately it all comes down to surrendering to what is, which then opens you up to the acceptance of what is. And once you start to accept everything really as it is, you can then begin to appreciate. And appreciation leads to all sorts of wonderful things. So this is an advice for anyone who's experiencing any kind of depression. 
is first of all remember to get out into nature that's helpful remember to do deep breathing that's helpful and if you're really beyond all those things that's because you've gone into a place of deep depression and it's this opportunity to surrender to those feelings and to allow the gifts to come to you because every moment represents a possibility of a new gift a new insight a new understanding a new way of being new feelings about yourself and your life so i invite you if you're in a deep depression go deep in and find out the riches which are there waiting for you to be discovered by you and it's only you that can make those discoveries thank you very much